Sup guys, thank you first and foremost for clicking on this video. Secondly, this video is proudly sponsored by these guys, Headspace. Headspace has one mission, to improve the health and happiness of the world. With millions of users in over 190 countries, they're well on the way to doing that. Originally created by an academic who decided to cut short a sports science degree to become a monk. He went on a journey lasting 10 years, traveling through Nepal, India, Russia, Thailand, Burma, and Australia, before returning to the UK with a mission to share what he had learnt with as many people as possible. And if we look back in history, that does ring a bell. From the academic classrooms in the UK, all over the world, and back again, Headspace was first just an idea, then a small meditation consultancy to an events company, and through an epic business partnership between a monk and a tech whiz, we now have the app called Headspace. So guys, by all means, head down into the description box below, check out Headspace for free, join me and millions of other people around the world experiencing a greater sense of mental health and mental well-being through the use of Headspace. You owe it to yourself and you owe it to everyone around you to take some time and look after your mental health. Thanks for watching guys and enjoy the video. Sup guys, welcome back to another episode of Rugby Player Reacts. I am your host, Jacob McDonald, and it's my absolute pleasure to bring you uh, a man by the name of David Bakhtiari. Quite well known around the traps, isn't he? In fact, if nothing else, he's definitely known for chugging beer. But all of that and more will be revealed as we get into the video. This is a video series titled The NFL's Top 100 Players of 2021. I am giving you my reaction to it as a rugby player. I've played rugby for 20 years. Um, I'm a New Zealander. We have the world's number one rugby team. In fact, we have the world's most successful international sporting franchise. And I'm going to leave that one with you. So without further ado, it's time we roll the intro and crack into it. So... Really, there's nothing left to do but to press play and should be a bit of entertainment, at the very least. Let's go. The guy that left an impression on me the most is probably Bakhtiari. He's the best O-lineman. The best O-lineman from a guy like Miles Garrett. I'll tell you what, that's some real praise. He's a guy great with communication. He'll be actually watching the Jumbotron just to see what the O-line is doing on the opposite. Good looking cat, isn't he? He is, I must admit. Maybe it's the blue eyes, maybe it's the beard, maybe it's the ability to chug a pint of beer in a second. Whatever it is, he leaves a lasting impression. Team, man, just to help me. When I come back to the sideline, he'll be like, see, this is what you need to do. I've seen you get a hit, I've seen you get a sack. When am I gonna see a sack fumble and when am I gonna see a sack fumble for a touchdown? Okay, that's what you want? Love Bakhtiari, <laughs> man, great guy. And I remember that play, Bakhtiari <laughs> ran all the way downfield. 70 yards. His speed is just tremendous. Go, man. boy! Get this, son. Oh, you're kidding me. He's actually used as a blocker. <laughs> and to the sideline, I had a bottle of water ready. Way to stay alive, we'd say in rugby. Way to stay alive. For him. That boy is good. I just feel like. I just feel like he's good. His technique is really good. Well, I tell you what, I think is really good. A, a night out in the piss. Actually, a night out in the town with David Bakhtiari and Brandon Graham. Now that'll be entertaining. I love his stance. That's what kind of helps him because of how he can kick. He's probably the most funkiest set out of all of us tackles, but somehow it works for him. Everyone has their funky little things that they do, but the way he kicks his leg out and gets all set and... <laughs> <laughs> it's not often that a left tackle has to do a diving block like that, is it? All of a sudden he locks up some of the best pass rushers in the league. You do what you gotta do, I guess. David Bakatari, David Bakatari, Bakatari, Bakatari. When it comes to, to pass protection and, and protecting the quarterback, he's one of the best there is. I just feel like he's tough. It's probably the hair. He does have a nice set of locks. 
But then again, so do a lot of these guys. He usually don't give up sacks. Yeah, he's a top left tackle in the league. knows what he does best and does it mm. and never gets beat doing it to be a dominant tackle you do the same thing over and over again and it works and then why change it exactly and look we've got 13 seconds to go on this video but i do want to look up his stats just quickly because he is uh, a veteran 29 years of age you wouldn't know it he looks about 21 six foot four 310 pounds pick number 109 in the fourth round of the 2013 draft He's been at the Packers ever since. They don't have any of his NFL stats here, which is interesting. Is that because he's a left tackle and they don't really record too many stats? I'm not sure. In his rookie year, he became the first rookie in Green Bay to start every single game at left tackle since the start of the 16-game schedule employed by the NFL since 1978. And the only NFL rookie to start every game that season at left tackle in 2013. And here we are eight years later. He's still at the Packers, but he is unfortunately placed on the reserve slash pup list but what he did do last year is uh, not only make the pro bowl but also make for the second time in his career the first team all pro in fact to be honest from what i see here as far as his career highlights and awards are concerned since 2016 he's come into his own and he's been absolutely balling out and before we conclude this video i just want to read you a quote from bakhtiari in high school Coming out of high school, Bakhtiari was 6 feet 4 inches tall and weighed 266 pounds and was ranked only as a two-star prospect by Rivals.com. In a 2009 interview at the age of 18, Bakhtiari commented, People come up to me and go, oh, you're only a two-star. But I don't really care what my ranking is. All that matters is how you do when you put on the pads. He received interest from several schools, receiving offers and visiting Colorado, Utah, UTEP and Washington before signing his letter of intent with Colorado. He played for the Colorado Buffaloes football team from 2009 to 2012 and as we know got picked up in the 2013 draft by the Packers. His name is David Bakhtiari. He's a bit of a cult hero around the league and uh, let's finish this video off. It is an interesting looking kickback though. But I'll tell you what, the one moment from that video that springs to mind is the diving block that he performed on his opposite man. Can you imagine a guy that's six foot four, 300 and something pounds, diving for your legs? Not very nice, is it? It would not be very nice at all. Anyways guys, that brings us to the end of another video. We are almost two thirds of the way through. Thank you for watching, thank you for the support. If you have enjoyed it, hit the like button. If you want to head down into the description box below and check out our exclusive video sponsor, that would be amazing. But if nothing else, stay tuned and I'll see you back here shortly. Peace out, guys.